Are you ready to hit the streets once more? Local Legends, the latest sourcebook for City of Mist, is now released. You can pick up the digital PDFs today at cityofmist.co. You can also pre-order the physical book, which is coming in November. Pre-ordering will reserve your copy at a discounted price. Now, whether you were a part of the original crowdfunding campaign, or you're just joining us now, you'll be excited to hear about all of the stuff that's been jam-packed into this book. Local Legends is an expansion collecting nine districts, each bundled with new lore, allies, dangers, custom player options, custom mechanics, and a case that ties it all together. That's nine new cases that your crew can run as one-shots, making this book not only a great way to enrich your existing City of Mist campaign, but also a treasure trove of opportunities to play City of Mist with a new group for just one non-committal night. So first, let's go on a quick tour. The City of Mist has always been home to the mundane and the mythical, and these nine districts are no different. Each is a distinct melting pot of cultures and ideas, intermingling their stories to form all new tales. To make sure these melting pots had the best ingredients, Sun of Oak hired a formidable roster of veteran and rising TTRPG writers from many different walks of life to add their own experiences to the City of Mist. One of these new districts is the long-requested Chinatown. Here you can find demigods practicing high-flying martial arts, alongside elusive spirits and hidden dragons. Your characters can also use the new Tradition theme book to draw upon the strengths of their community or heritage. Now, if you're looking to test your luck, Fortune Row is where you should go. In this district of glitzy casinos and sly conmen, luck itself can be won in a game of roulette or stolen in a high-risk heist. Use the new heist rules to come up with a quick, exciting caper on the spot. Come to Happyville if you want a slice of simple, small-town Americana. Walk past all the manicured lawns and enjoy a cup of joe at Celia's Coffee Shop. Just know that underneath the saccharine veneer, Happyville is seething with the stuff of 1950s conspiracy theories. Join the fight against oppression in independence. This bustling black community is home to rifts of African-American folk heroes like John Henry and High John the Conqueror. When you're not fighting the oppressive gatekeepers of Ward 9, grab the best bourbon in town at the Freeport Speakeasy. Now on the other side of town is La Colonia de Sombras. Here you can join the luchadora superhero La Aguila de Plata, the Silver Eagle, in her war against the mythical Tio Tez and his empire of crime and corruption. A war that makes both of them blind to the Mesoamerican horrors that lurk in the shadows. Underneath all of these districts is the Undertrash, an impossibly large underground world where sewers turn into mythical caves. The Undertrash is where all of the abandoned and destitute end up, but rumors abound of treasure lurking within its most forgotten corners. Now if you really do your research, you may be able to discover the Sunken City. This pseudo-Atlantis goes full pulp action. Throw off the shackles of the mist, unleash your powers, and go on daring underwater adventures. Just make sure you can handle the pressure. But if you want to cut loose in an easier way, then head on down to the Taurus Trap. Here, the Rift of Dionysus will serve you drinks, while jackalope skateboarders serve up sick tricks. But not all of it is fun in games. In the case Maestro of Chalk, your crew must figure out who's bringing monstrous chalk drawings to life. And this final district was chosen by the Kickstarter backers. Pursue higher education at the campus, a place of secret societies and hollowed learning. Hit the books with the new Esoterica theme book and discover the magic they've been hiding away from you. If you're willing to perform a blood sacrifice on the quad, the campus is for you. Local Legends also offers bonus content outside of everything stuffed into the nine districts. This includes four small-time villain profiles that can be placed anywhere in the city and in any campaign. These smaller criminal operations are perfect for side cases, random encounters, mini-bosses, or even reluctant allies should your crew make deals with the criminal underworld. How will your crew handle the murderous Rift of Geppetto, the vindictive Rift of Medusa, the revenge-driven Rift of Robin Hood, or the glory-seeking Rift of Sinbad? 
and along with the nine district cases, Local Legends includes a tenth bonus case called Forged and Framed. After your crew is framed for a missing museum piece, they must break out of jail and discover the real culprits behind the theft. This case is written by Logan Reese, aka Runesmith, and if you want to learn more about it, you can check out our interview with Runesmith here. So what comes next? As I said at the beginning of this video, you can pick up a digital copy of Local Legends right now. The physical release of the book is currently slated for late November, and if you want the latest updates on that timeline, be sure to subscribe to this channel, check out the Sun of Oak social media pages, and maybe even join the official Discord. You can find all of those links in the description. Sun of Oak will also be releasing new accessories for Local Legends. This includes new Local Legends dice in luminous yellow and brick maroon. There will also be a new deck of legends that collects the many dangers within the book and presents them on easy-to-reference cards. And if you want to get really into the mystery, Son of Oak will be releasing a new crime board map. As your players discover clues, they can physically place them on the map to uncover the mystery. Pins and yarn not included. Honestly, the accessory I'm most excited about is the local legends character folios. These pre-made character sheets let you jump right into the action. You can play as a prominent character from each one of the districts and make their stories your own. You can play as the Silver Eagle herself, or as new characters like Vance, the Rift of Poseidon, who rides the waves in the Taurus Trap and has a real anger problem, or Chester, the Rift of the Cheshire Cat, who mixes things up in the campus. These character folios also function as stylish posters you can hang on your wall. And hey, if you'd like us to talk about these characters in a later video, let us know in the comments. Sun of Oak Game Studio is so excited to return to the City of Mist. And while I can't get into it just yet, I can say there will be another big City of Mist Kickstarter just around the corner. But until next time, have fun!